Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, I will teach you how to multiply mixed numbers. So without further ado, let's do this topic. For this video, I will give you two examples on how to multiply mixed numbers. And let's start with example number one. In number one, we are given the mixed numbers 4 and 1 over 6 times 2 and 2 over 3. Now basically, we cannot directly multiply these mixed numbers to another mixed number. So what we need to do is to convert these mixed numbers into improper fraction. So first, multiply the denominator by the whole number. 6 times 4, that is 24. Then add this one and the numerator. We have 24 plus 1, which is equal to 20. Five, then copy your original denominator, which is 6, times, convert also this one into mixed number, or improper fraction, 3 times 2, that is equal to 6, then plus 2, that is equal to 8 over, copy your denominator, which is 3. Now, here's the thing. What we're going to do here is to directly multiply this numerator by another numerator, denominator, and denominator. By the way guys, uh, medyo malat yung aking boses. And pagpasansya nyo na, we're going to continue this, this video. <coughs> so instead of multiplying it, why not simplify mo muna yung mga common numbers or yung numbers na pwede pa simplify. Here, you can do cancellation with number, with 8 and 6. Itong 6 natin, saka 8 natin, they are both divisible by 2. Or pwede kong sabihin na, their GCF is 2. So, gagawin natin itong 4, and this one is equal to 3. So, what will happen is that we can now directly multiply the numbers. 25 times 4, that is equal to 100 over 3 times 3, that is equal to 9. In some other cases, your teacher might accept this 100 over 9. But this one is an improper fraction. So let me remind you, what is an improper fraction? The numerator is greater than the denominator. So what we need to do here is to convert this into a mixed number. So how are we going to do that? Let's create here a division, long division process. So we will divide 100 by 9. So first, 1 divided by 9 cannot be. But this one, 10 divided by 9 is equal to 1. 1 times 9 is 9. Subtract. This is 1. Bring down 0. Now, 10 divided by 9 is also 1. 1 times 9 is what? 9. Subtract this. As you can see, the remainder is 1. So what will happen? This quotient is your new, is your whole number. So this 100 over 9 is equivalent to 11. And then as for the fraction, this remainder is your numerator. And this divisor is your denominator. Meaning, the product of 4 and 1 6 times 2 and 2 thirds is equal to 100 over 9 or... 11 and 1 over 9. So I hope guys, in the first example, nakuha nyo na yung process on how to multiply mixed numbers. So let's continue. Now for this example, you have 4, ah sorry, 1 and 4 over 5 times 1 and 1 half. Now I will give you the time to solve this first before we dive in or before I discuss these examples. By the way, you can pause the video for a while. Okay, let's continue. Convert this into mixed number. Multiply. 5 times 1 is 5. Then add this. This is equal to 9. Then copy your denominator, which is 5. Times. 
it's 1, 1 half. Convert this. Multiply. 2 times 1 is 2. Plus 1. This is 3 over 2. Now, do we have some numbers that when, that we can simplify? So far, wala pa naman. So we will multiply this directly. 9 times 3 is 27 over. Multiply this. 5 times 2. This is equal to 10. And as you can see, this one is an improper fraction. So what we need to do is to do a long division. 27 divided by 10. 27 divided by 10 is 2. 2 times 10 is 20. Subtract these numbers. This is 7. This is our remainder. Now, what we have here is our quotient. This will serve as your new whole number. This divisor is your old denominator. The remainder is the numerator. Meaning, the product of 1 and 4 over 5 and 1 and 1 half is equivalent to 2 and 7 over 10. So this is the answer, guys. So as part of our routine, I will give you another mixed number that you need to multiply. And then I hope na you can put the answer or the product of these mixed numbers in the comment section below. So let's try number 3. I will give you 2 and 2 thirds times 1 and 3 over 5. So tell me guys in our comment section what is the answer. So that's it. I hope guys you learned something from this video on how to multiply mixed numbers. Guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit the bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!